In our last lesson, we took a look at this fruit tree and realized that two of the branches needed to come out. One is too horizontal, one is too vertical. They didn't meet our criteria of 10 o'clock and 2 o'clock. So we'll just cut those out and the tree will have much more light, much more air, and the existing branches will be a lot healthier. And we have our angles of 10 o'clock and 2 o'clock. There's one minor problem near the top. This branch starts out at the right angle but then goes horizontal. What we can do is direct growth by a proper pruning cut. We'll take off the horizontal extension of this branch and direct the growth at more of a proper angle. It's extremely important when making a cut to cut exactly at the proper place. Each branch as it meets the trunk creates an area, a swollen area, a collar if you will, that needs to be saved this is where the healing tissue originates. The sap in the tree comes up through the here. So your pruning cut needs to be on the outside of that branch collar. That's extremely important. If it's further out, it'll leave a stub and that won't heal. If it's too close to the trunk, it won't heal either. Some orchardists now are modifying the central leader system slightly. They'll cut out the center of the tree when it gets to be 8 or 10 feet tall. And then this tree will develop two or three leaders at the very top and increase fruit bearing area near the top of the mature tree which will be about 12 to 15 feet. Thanks for watching the video and stay tuned for the next lesson.